but I cannot preach like Dr. King or turn a poetic phrase like Maya Angelou, but I care. And I'm willing to serve and I'm willing to stand with others to build a movement to save all of our children. I don't have Harriet Tubman's courage or Eleanor Roosevelt's political skills, but I care. And I'm willing to serve and stand with others for our children. I cannot sing like Marian Anderson or Fannie Lou Hamer or organize like Ella Baker or Byatt Rustin, but I care. And I'm willing to stand and serve with others and build a movement for our children. Wish I was holy like Archbishop Tutu or forgiving like President Mandela or disciplined like Mahatma Gandhi. I'm not, but I care. And each of us can be willing to serve and stand with others for our children. I'm not brilliant like W.E.B. Du Bois or Elizabeth Cady Stanton or as eloquent as Sojourner Truth or Booker T. Washington. But all of us and I care and say I care and I'm willing to serve and do whatever I have to do to stand for our children. I wish I had Mother Teresa's saintliness, the Dalai Lama's or Dorothy Day's love, or Cesar Chavez's gentle, rough, tough spirit. But we don't. But we can all care and we can reach out and serve one child or many children and stand with others to build a movement that we have to have in our nation for all of our children. God is not as easy as the 60s to frame an issue and forge a solution. But we'll keep at it until we do, because we care. And I'm willing to serve and stand with others for children. My mind and body are not so swift as in youth, many grandparents and older people say. But, and my energy comes in spurts. But that's all right. When those spurts come, we can care and be willing to serve and stand with others to build a movement for our children. And I want to just salute all the grandmothers in this country and the grandfathers in this country who are struggling to raise generations of new children. Many young people say, I'm so young, nobody will listen. I'm not sure what to say or to do, but I care, and I'm willing to serve and stand with others for children. Some say, again, I don't see or hear well, can't speak good English, I stutter sometimes, I get real scared standing up before others. But get on up anyway when you're scared and say, I care. And I'm willing to serve and stand with others for our children. I hope as we leave here inspired by these extraordinary young people um, who are going to make us so proud and who are going to be our future servant leaders and already are, and we will ask God to use us as God wills to save our children today and tomorrow and to build a nation where no child is left behind. And every single sacred child is made to feel welcome in our nation and world.